Wrong wire. Wrong wire. Shit. Careful, you old bag of shit. You've already messed up everything else in your life. You don't want to mess this up, too. No, shut up. Like you'll want to talk after your little Winnebago honeymoon. How am I? I'm more worried about you. Are your guns still all uh, mad at each other? You all gotta get on the same page if you want to be garmantuous. I don't want you to fuck this up right at the finish line. Just keep it together. You've been doing a great job. You're sure you're doing this right, James. Whoa, be, be, be careful with him. Real smooth, Gene. That's supposed to happen. I know. I meant that sincerely. I just don't know actually how to be nice to you. Gene almost killed your super gun all over again. Don't listen to her. I'm about to do some real Frankenstein shit here. Oh, God. I don't know if I'm going to be able to look him in the eye. <sighs> That's fine. I think we accidentally severed his optic nerves earlier. What are you staring at, dork? Oh, yeah, right. Me and Gene, best buds. We had a real bonding moment a little while ago when I was helping him stuff a bag of dicks down his throat. Yeah, dream on, kid. I hope your sister gets space chlamydia. Wow, yeah, no, they're, they're getting along. All right, almost got it. Stand back, everyone. Here we go. Is he... Wait for it. Let's do it. Les, is that... Is that you? Let's do it. Oh. I might have fucked up his speech centers, too. Let's do it! Let's do it! Talk to me! Let's do it! So what, all he can say is his name? This is sad. Listen, everything else I did was perfect. He can shoot, he can think, he can shit, he just can't talk right. But he's all in there, right? Like, he knows who I am? Let's do it! Les, I, I can't... Let's do it! I'm so sorry, I... Let's do it! I can't believe I didn't have to tell everybody what I did. Are you kidding, are you kidding me right now? Fuck off, kitty. Kenny. Fuck off. What? What? I And I'm happy to see my friend, okay? Fuck. See, I'm not the worst scumbag here. Wow, this is really it, huh? Let's do it. You got the earth coordinates, right? It's time for your final mission. Hey, kid. Looks like we made a pretty good team. It's been quite the journey. <laughs> This might be the end of the line, so make sure you finish up everything you wanted to do before we head back to Earth. You, uh, ready to go? You bet, kid. Take all the time you need.
Come see what I've got in stock on the food menu. Yo, bounty hunter, come see what I've got in stock on the food menu. Hi, bounty hunter. Don't go blabbing about this place. Sure thing. That was a great transaction of food for money. Goodbye. Oh, hey, honey, how's it going? Um, it's going okay. Uh, I have... You don't have to run wow, everywhere. Cool. You, know, you might want to slow down and enjoy the scenery look, once in a while. Look at this place. What I got to tell you, I, I, it's going to be a while, okay? You got my last drops. Okay, you saunter away. I wasn't saying nothing. Hello, welcome to our store. Fuck you. Oh, hey, get your hands off. That's not for sale. You forget you're in a store, S-T-O-R-E, as it eat my shit. Get your hands off, that's not for sale. Good eye, that thing's a real beauty. Oh, sorry, part. Good eye. Oh, sorry, partner, that's not for sale. Jorp, I need you out of the house tomorrow night. I've got a big date. I don't want you dating. That is not up to you, Jorp. Your dad has needs. I'm gonna tell Mom. That's fine. You can tell your mother whatever you want. Great, then I'm gonna tell her you died and we'll have a great big party. And we're gonna get your favorite... Oh, well, maybe next time. Again. Thanks so much. Hello? Who's there? Are you trying to prank call me? Okay. Good work. You got me. 
I don't give a shit. You think I care about getting pranked? Okay, fuck you! I've got powerful friends. I know a really strong bounty hunter, and I'm gonna send him to kick your ass! How do you like that, huh? Hello? Who is this? If this is Nancy from the City Comptroller, I actually would like to speak to you. Is this Nancy? Well, I'll tell you what, if it is or isn't, maybe you could pass on the message to Nancy because I'm not sure if you're aware, but on my block on 67 Rosebud, well, the Rosebud Avenue between uh, Terrace uh, Court and uh, Jarvis Street, in that, in that area, I have a pool in the back of my yard. It's a saltwater pool, and the neighborhood boys, they come around on their fucking BMX bikes, and they, they ride all over my, my, my rose garden, but that's not the, where it ends, is they take the little rocks and the little pieces of fertilizer and soil from my garden, and they throw it into my fucking pool, and all those goddamn little rocks, they get into the filter, and I gotta change that thing out every single time they do it. And those filters are about $700. So, I don't know if that's part of your jurisdiction, but maybe could you get somebody out here to figure that fucking shit out, otherwise I'm gonna have to take matters into my own hands. And I've killed before. Now, legally, it was under, uh, it was in war. I have been, I have served, but I know what it's like to take a life. And I will do it to the children, or at least their fucking parents, because I'm out $1,400, and if you can't do the math, Nancy, that's two fucking filters. So, if you'd get back to me as soon as you can, or, 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 or I guess if you can pass this on to Nancy, just let me know and I'll figure it out. And if it's one of your little shits crank calling me, I'm gonna take matters into my own hands. You just wait. Just walk away. Ready, bounty hunter? Let's show them what we can do. and months of planning before that where you had every opportunity Sisters, maybe? Just trying to get to the bottom of this. Yeah, and you took her name. That's very progressive of you. Yeah, well, you know, it's, it didn't seem like the right thing to do. I don't know. We would have shot you if you didn't. It was the right thing to do. Yeah. Well, I mean... Ah, you're back, you're back. Hey, come on through. Come right on through.
So, so what are you? Well, okay, I, I'll see you hey, next buddy, time. You or I'll be dead. Broken leg guy, still here. See you later. comes another fork at you.
we get? Hey, I know this has been hard. I'm, I'm really glad we have each other. But if you die, I'm gonna have to tell everyone about all that hentai I found on your computer. So don't die, because I, I don't want to have to tell everyone about all your hentai. Nobody's gonna give a shit. Everyone in space loves hentai. It's great. Thanks for putting your life on the line. It's, it's really cool of you, or whatever. Hey kid, looks like we made a pretty good team. It's been quite the journey. This might be the end of the line, so make sure you finish up everything you wanted to do before we head back to Earth. You, uh, ready to go? You bet, kid. Take all the time you need. Come one, come all, come marvel at the mist. Decided to take a look, have we? How fortuitous. Before you lies the mythical Zephyr Star Whale. Some say this mythical being pollinated the land with its mighty Star Whale Seed, which supposedly gave way to all life on Zephyr. That's the myth, but I know the truth. An old guy named Steven did it. He just jizzed everywhere a few thousand years ago and sort of just uh, became a god for this planet, I guess. The progenitor of all Zephyr life, including mites, fergals, and moplets. So good for Steven. All hail Steven. Ah, just thinking about him makes me all misty-eyed. Oh, I'm 
sorry. I hope we didn't offend you. I don't think so. I wish we were. Damn time. Oh, you want me out again, do you?
kill you. One less G3 to worry about. my glob shot, you know?
Look who's here. Thank God you showed up. This trolley is gonna crush all five of us. You need to pull that lever so the trolley will switch tracks. That's the only way we'll survive. Whoa, whoa, hold up. Don't pull that lever if you switch the tracks. I'll die instead of them. Right, but that way only one person will die. It's not ideal, but it's better than five people dying. I know I'd personally rather only one person die than five, but that's just me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Okay, you there watching us. You stumbled onto this trolley situation, and, and those five people were already gonna die whether you intervened or not. It's out of your hands, right? But if you pull that lever, you are actively going to kill me. You'll be making- Oh, thank you so much. We're saved! No, come on! I do it! Pull the lever again! Oh, I'm so relieved that I'll be able to survive this and give birth to two beautiful twins! I don't care if you have to kill unborn twins, I just don't want to die. Hey, what the fuck? Can't you again? Oh, God damn it! stop fucking with me. I'd rather you made a choice and stuck with it. No, this is great. You're making the right choice. Oh, shit, not again. Oh, God, thank you. But I'm going to die of a heart attack anyway if you keep doing what? it again. Oh, God damn it! stop fucking with me. I'd rather you made a choice and stuck with it. No, this is great. You're making the right choice. It's really obvious. We're all really proud of you. I wonder. I'm dying. Uh, don't you look away. Don't you dare you. You watch me die. You watch me like a fucking man. Uh, I am. Oh, Jesus. Well, I am glad that wasn't us. <laughs> just untied everyone real quick and let them all live. But uh, what you do is cool, too. Miss you. 